Hello everybody, I am Bones, and today we're doing the Texorcist. Oh, let's fix that thing. There we go. The Texorcist. Uh, this is a... The story of Ray Bibia. So it is exactly what you think it is. I think it's a text. Now this is a beta, so some features are not in yet. I'm told this will be updated. Uh, this is actually quite an early version of this game, as I understand it. My Reverend looks pissed off and ready for action already. I think he's actually wearing a priest outfit, so I think he's a priest. I feel like he was ready for this. Yikes, what did you do to me? What was that? Okay, so I have some things to keep track of now on the screen. Oh god, okay. I get it. Alright, I get it. I get it. I gotta be fast. Let's get on the shoot over here. This isn't just a typing game, you gotta move too. Uh, whoa! What the hell was that? I feel like this is a very action folk tutorial already. Oh my god. I'm not doing good right now. Oh, I thought I could do it. I thought I could do it. I did it. My guy is, uh, quite the badass here. Now, uh, alright. Type my name. Jones and Gary. But I never realized that said bag. Yes, I know now. So there I am. So this game uh, has some neat graphics. It reminds me a lot of like the old River City Ransom. 16-bit, however, I believe. I'm sure if it's shitty days never added, I should get that. So he's definitely an Irish priest. Yeah. That's gonna stir me up, I'm sure. I like him. Oh boy. Oh well, that's different. Uh, I'm guessing this is my navigator. At the street. 
anything to examine. Um, read. Use. Should probably always pee before we go and do an exorcism. And then let's wash our hands. Be cleanly at least. Now let's turn this on. Let's not turn this on. Uh, where the hell is our navigator then? Do I have it on you? Move. Okay, here it is. Everything is typed. That part's kind of interesting. That's a definitely an interesting little game so far. It should be the place. Everything seems to be under control. What is it? Done? I love that they say I think that two for this second click, so it's a typo. See, that's a joke. That's fairly not good. Floating kid above the bed. Oh, shit. They're not kidding around with this. Alright, so we're not gonna type on that. This is literally like a bullet hell game here. Yeah. Really? I already taken damage from this thing. Oh, that's not good. At all. Oh my god. We can do this. That skull is a jerk pants right there, so... Let's look out for that, shall we? Oh my god! Maybe we shouldn't stand so close to the demonic child. What are we doing here? Jeez, oh cheats, what the holy hell? The music's definitely good for this. Oh my god. Now she's on like turbo mode here. Come on, look at your bones, you can do this. Oh, you guys see that? A loop to do there. Skull's killing me, man. Skull's a jerk.
It's a hard game in a way because you not only have to type, but you have to move and keep figuring out what you're trying to do here. And then, on top of it, you have all this other stuff that's stopping you from typing. Um, it's definitely a lot harder than you would expect. For those of you out there who are like, Oh, what's you can't do this? Look, it's not just that you're trying to touch words. As you can see, like in this instance, I don't even know what the hell uh, I'm trying to type here. Maybe. Um, it was definitely not helping at all. Not that it should. I don't think it's a joyous thing by nature, but you know. Yahtzee. That was a close one. Right there. The next word is granted. So I'm trying to keep aware of the words, and I, oh my god, what the hell is that? <sighs> Only I could mess up granted, come on up. Honestly, I'm not normally these kind of guys. It's harder to type one-handed and uh, move with the other. I'm dodging bullets while I'm typing. Come on, all I have to type is me, the word me. I definitely think this guy should maybe consider slowing down the level of, uh, I'll try it again. The level of, uh, hey, college. Bullets. Oh. I feel like you just cannot wait to get in quick. I mean, to put it in perspective, this is our first exorcism. Mm -hmm. They're already going this way. One other thing that I would like to say is that this is clearly crazy um, because I, uh, I like this one. I do. But I definitely feel like the bullets for this one should probably be tweaked a little and try to get the game a little more. Maybe not as crazy with the first one. Just my own opinion. Um, the move and type dynamic is certainly a lot more fun than just typing. So I do enjoy that actually. I think it's a pretty novel idea here. That does work. I think. Um, it's actually pretty clever. Uh, ditto with the having to backtrack letters if you start to get this wrong because that certainly adds to the uh, adds to the craziness of the actual thing. Because I have to excuse me there, dogs are of course wanting to be in a video as well as normal. Not their first not their first rodeo. That was actually the dog that you've seen in a lot of our videos that was barking just then. So he's he's apparently getting his words in this game too. Now you can see the difference when I'm typing one-handed and two-handed here, but this is a hell of a lot harder uh, like this. But oh my god. I'm also not taking as much damage, so that's the trick, isn't it? And I'm kind of going back and forth here. I feel like for the, uh, I'm gonna try something here, let's try this. So for the two bigger words, they're like darkness, uh, I'm trying to, I'm trying to do um, two-handed typing for those and moving this. It could be smaller ones here. See that skull is killing me. I don't know what I'm doing here. No! 
try it one more time. Oh. Yeah, I should have known that was gonna get hurt immediately. Oh my god. Certainly a difficult game. Uh, I will say that. More so than you would expect. Especially with the whole bullet hole thing going on. So my new strategy is going to be to do all words one-handed, no matter how big they are. Because I just don't think you can do two handed very easily. Uh, I'm normally an extremely fast type of but because of the fact that I have to watch so many bullets on the screen, it's a bit harder. Those of you out there that are like, oh, didn't you have typing class? Oh. Yeah, I did, but I never paid attention. Let's go with the pain in the ass. I will say I do think that uh, it seems to be possible at least to get a bit of a rhythm going, but it's not as easy as you would think. It is certainly a slow burn on doing this, because I do, I do I feel like you really kind of gotta pay more attention to the bullets than the piping, right now anyway. Not that I think that I, it's going to continue like that, but I do think that... Um, and again, this is an early, you know, so I don't think it will probably remain the same way. I'm sure it'll be balanced a little more. So what we're seeing may not necessarily represent the final product as far as difficulty, unless it does, but I, I don't... I'm suspecting that uh, this developer will more than likely take uh, play, do, play test so this if they see and actually use it as a litmus test, uh, as it were, of... Alright, well this seems to be as difficult as I need this to be, this doesn't, etc, etc, etc. See, that's a sneaky one, I think. That's crazy. Don't, don't. I need my beebles. I need my beebles. Can't do this without my beebles. Okay. Jesus H. That's insanity right there. Look at the bullets, man. It's crazy animals. Oh my god. Shush! Almost no way to avoid that one. 
that part's kind of crummy. But I'll do my best, man. You can do this, bones. We're trying to banish the monster, aren't we? Holy cow. There's absolutely no way. I don't even mess with that yet. We got this dude. Um, um, what in the hell? Um. Yeah, craziness right there, guys. Crazy. But an interesting, uh, an interesting game. I'll, I'll give it credit there. Um, no, my thoughts on it so far. Um, short video just because I can't really get farther in it. I'll we'll have to play a bit while I talk this, folks. See if we can at least figure this out. Uh, so, what's going on here is we are typing and reading in one game. And then if you get hit, you gotta run and grab your beebles. Uh, I do like the moving aspect especially because yeah, the only other big game where you do monster hunting and typing like this that I remember anyway, and maybe I'm wrong, but it was Typing of the Dead for the Sega Dreamcast. Um, the animations are impressively fluid for this. Uh, all the art is very well done, in my opinion, and the music is appropriately catchy. If you want it to be in a bullet hell game, it's got to be catchy. And uh, this is certainly enough bullets that you're dodging to be classified as both a Titan and bullet hell. I don't think you can really avoid that because it just got crazy with uh, the stuff that you've got to be on the lookout for. Uh, now, if I have any recommendations to the dev, I would say maybe nix the insane amount of bulletry on this first encounter a bit. Uh, I feel like at some points it gets to where dodging is just not really a good option. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Um, been a while since I played something like this. Uh, in any case, I'd say if you like quirky games, you like bullet hells, or you like something different, you want know, something different, this would certainly be one to watch. Uh, the the again the art here alone is decent, quite decent and impressive. Uh, I thought it looked alright, but uh, after playing it, it looks much better than I even saw in screenshots. So that's. That's saying something, guys. Um, the music actually is a pleasant surprise as well. Uh, you know, here is a, a YouTuber. We do get offered an, a certain amount of keys that we do turn down. Um, there was no way I was turning down a game cover about doing an exorcism. Uh, and was pretty pleasantly surprised to find out, guys, that uh, this game is far better than I expected it to be. Actually, it looks, uh, no, it, despite the insane level of difficulty here, in my opinion, I feel like the game itself plays well. Uh, the, the mechanics, the general mechanics of it are pretty easy to pick up. The hard part is trying to... I feel like it's going to take a few tries, for me at least, to understand the exact timing I need to do both typing uh, and dodging. And I feel like for each level, you're going to find a different rhythm to it. You know what I mean? I think that's my problem here, is I just don't have the rhythm down right when it comes down to typing, because... Obviously, the general idea is if you type quickly, you beat the level quicker. Sure, but when you have all these bully bullets coming at you, 
You also want to make sure that you're not walking into a ton of bullets like I did the first few tries especially. Um, and I know they're not technically bullets, spear, whatever, but uh, you get the idea. The basic thing here that I'm saying is that uh, for any game like this, you really want to watch that because you never know. The vomit in this level seems to confuse you for a moment. Uh, which is, again, I don't feel that's cheap. I feel like that's appropriate. So I really have no complaints with that card. My only complaint is in the friggin' difficulty for this being the first basic uh, uh, encounter is a bit high, I feel, but again, that might just be me. You guys might do much better with it. Um, as I said, this is a beta right now, so this will get updated a lot. Um, so there you have it. We're gonna end that here. This is uh, the texture assist. Make sure you guys check it out. The link will be below. I am yours truly, uh, Bones. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe, give us a like, and make sure to stay tuned for more craziness. Some new, new looks for Bones coming uh, soon. You guys will see. Have fun. Ooh.